somebody with dignity and respect, it's almost impossible to be labeled a toxic leader. Now, standards are important. You know, being in the military, I mean, we're all about standards, and I'm sure in your line of work, you're all about standards. Standards have to be met. But I think you could hold somebody to a standard in a dignified and respectful way. Right? You don't chew them out or yell at them in front of uh, their peers. You take them on the side and you explain, hey, you're not meeting the standard here. Uh, you know, there's something going on at home or what, what, what's the story here? But you do it privately and you do it respect, respectfully. I think you could even fire somebody in a dignified and respectful manner. Right? So to say you're going to treat people dignified and respectful doesn't mean that you're going to be a pushover. It doesn't mean you're not going to adhere to standards. Because those are very, very important in our line of work. People's lives count, uh, depend on that, right? So, uh, yeah, thank you for mentioning that.